All right, so we got the Timney trigger, the CAA pistol grip, we got the pistol grip screw, pistol grip block washer, pistol grip end cap, strip blower receiver, I believe that's a Magpul trigger guard, trigger guard screw, trigger guard roll pin, magazine catch, magazine catch spring, magazine release, got the Magpul bad lever and the hardware. We got our bolt catch, bolt catch roll pin, bolt catch spring, bolt catch plunger. We got our we got our rear takedown spring, rear takedown plunger, pivot pin, spring, pivot pin, plunger. We got our buffer spring, buffer catch spring, buffer catch plunger. We got our takedown pin, pivot pin. These are just specialty tools for the AR. We got our gas tube roll pin, gas tube set screws, BCM barrel nut wrench, BCM barrel nut, KMR clamp blocks, KMR clamp block screw notched head. KMR cross bolt locking head. This is the rail alignment interface. Got our T15 Torx wrench. Got our T8 Torx wrench. Receiver extension. Castle nut. End plate. Buffer spring. Buffer. BCM Mod Zero Comp Crush Washer, BCM Barrel, BCM Gas Block, BCM Charging Handle, BCM Bolt Carrier Group, Spikes Tactical Melanited Gas Tube Mid Length, BCM Upper Receiver, BCM Key Mod Sling Mount, BCM Key mod sling mount inverted screws. We got our ejector o ring. BCM KMR 13 inch rail. We got our Magpul CTR mill spec stock. Rail covers. Tango down foreign grip with QD throw lever. Surefire scout light, I believe. The rear tactical ACOG mount, the rear tactical Harris bipod mount, BCM KMR aluminum rails, Magpul M bus, front and rear sight. We've got the cheap polymer rails that come with the come with the key mod. I believe that is it.